Are you looking for an alternative to the TI wishlist? Well, I'm glad to tell you that I have analyzed all available WooCommerce wishlist plugins and finally I came up with one ultimate choice. Do you want to see the results? Keep watching till the end. What's up guys? Today I want to tell you the story of my journey to finding a better option than TI wishlist. The TI wishlist offers useful features, but honestly, after using it for a while, I wondered if that's all a wishlist can do. With tons of customer data and marketing opportunities, I was sure there was a great plugin out there that uses the maximum capability of a wishlist. So, I decided to search and get to know other wishlist plugins. I typed wishlist in the WordPress search bar and the results showed 30 different wishlist plugins. You can see their names here. But 30 was a pretty large number. I needed some filters to limit the options. So, I tried to remove outlier options using these factors. Number 1. Updates How many updates does the plugin go through? Updates indicate how much developers focus on improving the plugin and if they are still competing in the market or not. To find the out of order plugins, I set the maximum number of the last update to 1 month. This way, 12 plugins with more than 1 month from the last update have been eliminated. Number 2. Active users Ok, let's be honest here. None of us wants to struggle with bugs and issues just because a plugin has been released recently. Instead, I will choose a plugin released over a year ago with at least 100 users. With these conditions, 3 other plugins were removed. Number 3. 5 star value Ratings are usually good indicators to determine whether a plugin is performing poorly or well. People may get excited if a plugin is doing great and they go for a 5 star. And if the plugin fails to meet their expectations, they will likely select a 1 star for the poor performance. To measure the ratings equally, I calculated the 5 star value of each plugin's rating. By the value, I mean I divided the number of 5 star reviews by the total reviews and then multiplied the results by 5. Then anything below 2.5 was unacceptable. Well, when half the reviews say the plugin is not good, why should I pick it? This process deleted 5 plugins from the list. User experience and user interface design. You may know that YITH wishlist is the oldest wishlist among these plugins. So, this plugin became a standard for designing the settings interface of other plugins. But YITH wishlist doesn't offer a user friendly design, and other plugins lack this feature too. If you look at TI wishlist settings, you feel that developers dedicated time and effort to build a different admin panel that users easily engage. Except for MC wishlist, which offers a charming interface design and well partitioned settings. Other plugins couldn't pass this ease of use filter. However, I decided to keep three other plugins that might have offered a different UX design. Number 5 Options on Free Version One of the good features of TI Wishlist is offering several options to personalize the wishlist on the free version. In this research, I came along with a non interesting fact. All the wishlists offered similar options on the free version. Wishlist button design, wishlist table settings, sharing options, and customized text. However, MC Wishlist again surprised me with its free features. In the first section, you can easily customize the display settings. For example, after clicking the button, you can pick one action after the user clicks the Add to Wishlist button. The login option is a feature that most of the plugins offer it in the premium version, but you have it on the free version of the MC Wishlist. And the pop-up section provides options to personalize the pop-ups that appear to redirect users to the wishlist page. For example, there are 5 positions for pop-ups to appear and you can embed images into pop-ups. For the wishlist button tab, you have 4 different sections including single product page, product list, button and tooltip custom text and custom text for notifications. The first two sections are full of options that enable you to play with the wishlist button. The options deal with features such as icon, color, position, size, style, and so on. 
The plugin also gives you an easy to use customization kit that helps you in picking the best color for all details. The wishlist page tab includes the list of items you add to your wishlist and some options to share them. The settings of customizing the page have been organized into four sections page settings, table settings, login notice, and share settings. The general settings of the wishlist page are available. Also, it's possible to enable sharing and login notices for the page. It's up to you to decide which items are shown in the table by simply checking or unchecking them. And also, you have two options for the view mode, list and grid. Another useful tab is counter settings. In this tab, the plugin offers you a mini wishlist including some details of the purchase that appears when the user clicks on the counter icon. The email automation allows you to send email to your users based on your terms. The plugin offers a unique template for the emails, including logo, avatar, email sender full name, and social media links, allowing you to design your own template. And in the conditions tab, you can set some features like repeat promotion period and minimum price of total wishes items. These conditions enable you to build an efficient email automation plan. And in the next tab, you have numerous choices for coupons so that you and the customer both benefit from them. And finally, in the last section called Email Design Options, the statue summary of all emails is shown. To customize the email, click on the Manage button and you can see a text editor and three input text fields allowing you to manage the email. And the amazing fact is that all these features are available in the free version. To make the long story short, plugins like TI Wishlist can be considered an analytical tool that highlights users' habits and desires. But if you're looking for more sales, TI Wishlist may not do the job for you. So what's the alternative? In this video, I gave you insights into all available Wishlist plugins. I highly recommend you replace TI Wishlist with the MC Wishlist plugin and benefit from its other fantastic features in addition to the wishlist. Finally, I would be happy to hear your comments from this video. Don't forget to subscribe us to find fresh ideas about WordPress and marketing. Have a good day. Goodbye.